What's up, Castaways? Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KG48, and welcome back to Stranded Deep. All right, so I'm just running around here grabbing all of the fiber sleeves I can. Uh, fiber sleeves are becoming a real problem for me uh, right now. Although, every, like, I'm trying to figure out what to farm next, okay? I, I have an open farm plot. A lot of people are telling me potatoes, but here's the thing. I'm not, I don't have any shortage of potatoes right now. Uh, I've, I've got a pretty decent amount of fuel right now, so, uh, you know, guys, I think I'm going to go with the fiber sleeves because I seem to need them more because you need a lot of them. You need them for cloth. You need cloth for a lot of different things. Uh, you need the fiber sleeves for rope, a lot of that stuff, but but I will make the next one a potato plant for sure uh, or a potato thingy. Um, I might want to break. Can you, like, break these up? Like, what if I wanted to break this one up and plant it here, break this one up and plant it here? I wonder how I would... Well, I guess I, I guess if you destroy these, you could probably destroy these. That's what I'm thinking. Um, eventually, I'm going to want... All right, this is going to be fiber sleeves, right? But I kind of wanted to move this PP plant over to here and have this one be a potato one. So the potato ones are close to each other. I don't know. I'm, I'll figure that out as we go. It really doesn't matter that much. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and plant this right here. Okay. And I also got a PP plant, which is great. Uh, today, we are going to be building up the raft. We're going to fit a bunch of storage on it, and then we're going to go check out that that plot of land right there, that um, that uh, player-made island uh, with all the secrets, like the snake pits of death and stuff like that. Um, we're going to go over there and check that out, because I'm, I'm thinking there's a lot of stuff I haven't seen on there yet. And I'm, and I'm going to bring the storage so like I can like actually you know, have the storage I need to bring stuff back and forth from there. Uh, but first, first things first, let's go ahead and dump all this stuff off over here. Yeah, there we go. Just dump all these in here. Originally, I was making rope with these, like, right away. And that was a mistake, because you don't know what you're going to need with them. Am I going to need rope, or am I going to need, you know, cloth? So I'm not going to make the rope until I actually need it from this point forward. What I am going to need is a coconut flask. And there we go. Another antidote. Beautiful. And then we need to find out where we're... Oh, boy. Yeah, this is, this is full as hell. Um, <laughs> oh boy, uh, yeah, I would need another food container, I think. Uh, I guess for now, I'll just have, like, a coconut container or something. I mean, that'll be good enough for now, so, uh, but, uh, you know, I, mm. yeah, this is gonna be tough, because you put another food one, I might not have enough room for all the coconuts I'm gathering. I'm gathering all of the coconuts I come across, uh, just because, like, the, the only things that make flasks, flasks make antidote. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm being overly concerned about it. Maybe. Who knows? But that's what I'm doing. Let me do some organizing, guys, and then I'm going to get ready, probably sleep through the night, and then tomorrow we are going to build some storage on our raft. Um, it got too late to sleep, so I'm just working through the night. Um, I've been doing a lot of off-camera work, but there's something I definitely wanted to show you, because this is what it's all about, guys. It's going to be freaking cool. All right, so let's hop up here, and let's put some storage on this thing. Look at that. Wait, come on. Go. Do it. It's a little tricky to get it in the spot I want. Um, I kind of want it there, but I want it in the middle one first. There we go. All right, and then we'll put another one right here. Come on, work with me. Looks like we gotta turn it around. Uh, uh, there we go. I don't know if it matters, like when the, there we go, beautiful. Um, all right, well, let's just put some more on the hell with it. Uh, come on, turn around there, thank you, and nope, we're out. Okay, well, you know what? Three spots is great. That's nine crates I can bring with me, not including the ones I can hold. And that, my friends, is why this raft is going to be awesome. I'm so freaking hyped. So we're going to go, th we're going to go grab three of these things, and we are going to plop it right on there. Uh, let's go ahead and drop the stuff we don't need. There, there. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, only five? Right, I'm going to drop that one because I do want to be able to hold this. Can I pick that one up? There we go. Uh, you know what? Why don't we do this? This would make sense. We're bringing all this stuff with me anyway. So let's put a lot of it away so we can carry more of these. Beautiful. Beautiful. This is when the rafts really start getting good. You know there's a gyrocopter in the game. Well, you guys probably know that. Um, but I don't know, man. I think with the storage, I don't think the gyrocopter is really that worth it, to be honest. With the amount of storage you can carry on these rafts, 
you know, especially with the with the boat motor. Ugh. It's crazy. Alright, let's go ahead and drop this. One, two, th nope. Two, three. One, two, th no, stop grabbing it. Okay, beautiful. So we could still fit two more on there. All right, so I'm going to spend the rest of the night gathering all the materials I'm going to need for this, get all of the storage over here, and we are going to have a great time at that island. We're going to clear out that island today. It's going to be great. So, you know, I was thinking, I loaded this thing up with boxes. I'm going to, I already have boxes at this island. Why well, bring empty boxes when I've already got empty boxes I couldn't even bring back the first time? So, I am loaded up with all of the stuff I'm going to need. Hopefully, I didn't forget anything, although I probably did. And, um, yeah, we should be good to go. I know there's a lot of empty boxes already on the beach, and I expect to find more boxes up there because those those three things are where I'm going to be looking around today. Um, I'm also going to grab some stone from this island because there's a decent amount of stone on the island, and I have, like, almost none on mine. So, eh, and I still got that pig there, too. That is funny. All right, so let's drop off stuff we're not going to need. What are we not going to need? Um, well, I'm not going to need the axe until I'm actually ready to do that uh, the axe stuff, and I'm not going to do that, at the, like, right away. I'm probably not going to need the knife either. Um, I'm not going to need the drink things with me. Probably won't need the food. And probably won't need the hammer either. Okay. One thing I do want to do before I go up there and check that stuff out is I am probably going to come into contact with snakes, and I'm going to want sticks, because I'm going to want... To make some spears. Like when I when I had my problems with snakes earlier, you know, I was not prepared because I didn't have spears. So I would like to have at least four spears. But I'd like to not chop down any big trees for them. Not that it really matters, but and there we go. And one more. Here we go. Okay. Now I will save the game. Alright, save. And we're ready to rock and roll. I don't really remember how to get up there, though. I, I think I had to go this way. Yeah, I had to go this way. Gotta be careful. Who knows what's... Still, like, that right there. That could have been a problem. Uh, maybe I should have brought the bandages with me, but... I'm gonna be optimistic and say I'm not gonna need the bandages. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. And if I do need them, I can always come down and get them. It's not like you bleed out in seconds, like in a lot of other games. In this game, you can bleed for quite a while before you uh, die. Now, before I go up up top, I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to check out this island, because I never did this island. So let's come on over here. Hopefully I don't get bit up by a shark. That would be wonderful. All right. And I already see a box over here. There's going to be some loot over here, for sure. Okay. All right, we got that. We got rocks. Oh, a barrel. Oh, that's right. There's another barrel on this island, too. Take the bobber. Take that. Uh, man, I got a lot of lot of freaking mecha like mechanical things. I'm going to start throwing these out. I'm just going to assume I don't need them. And I don't need five la label makers, either. So we're going to take the label maker as well. Well, if I can. There we go. And honestly, I don't really know what I need flares for, either. Probably nothing, but... I'm going to take the flare, because it might be useful at some point. Stupid rock. Oh, a hammerhead shark. Okay. So this is going to make it a little bit more difficult to get back on the other side. But I guess there's no point in waiting. Let's do it. Let's go. Don't bite me, you stupid hammerhead shark. Come on. Swim. Swim like you've never swam before. And I, there's a lot of meat on this island. <laughs> One thing's for sure, if I want to, like, cook, I will, I'll be alright. I'll be alright. Or at least put, you know, do the, the whole smoking thing. Alright. Let's get back up here, and let's get inside. I'm gonna go in there again at some point. Uh, I might have missed stuff, and I actually want to go in there for stone as well. But I think for the time being, we're gonna go up. How do I... There we go. We're gonna go up in here. This is what I really came here for. Now I have to listen for snakes. No snakes up here, huh? I'll take the hide. I don't want the vehicle engine part. Eh, I, I think I already have like four of these. I'm sure, I'll be okay with that. As long, I just want to keep an eye out for the gyrocopter stuff. Shh. Oh, tires. I don't need tires anymore. 
But if I did... Really, no snakes up here? I don't need any more jerry cans either. Let's make sure there's anything in it. Nope, okay. Do jerry cans ever come with stuff in them? Oh. Oh, there's a whole nother island up here. Holy crap. All right, we'll check that out in a minute. Just making sure. Okay. I'm going to be honest. I'm really surprised there's no snakes up here. Not a lot of loot either, though. Oh, here we go. Cool. All right. Some decent loot here. I need some chests, though. I'm getting full. I'm getting full here. Oh, a breath boost. All right. Nothing. Oh, more tires. Okay. Alright, there gonna be anything up here? Oh, barrels. I'm surprised there's no chests. No storage containers. Huh. Am I gonna have to go all the way down to, like, get more storage containers? Crap. I thought for sure there would have been storage containers up here. Son of a bee. Well, I don't want to lose the breath boost. I'm guessing the breath boost is something I can craft. But I'm going to come down here. And I think what I'm going to do is... I'm going to make a little, like... A little stockpile here. Of all my stuff. And then if I have to go down and get chests, I'll do it later. You know, we'll see if... What I'll do is I'm going to see if I get... If I actually get any chests up here. And at the end of the day, if I don't, I'll have a little stockpile. I'll go down... Grab like four or five chests and bring them all up here. Man, this is cool. It's like a whole other island. No snakes. Huh. It's awful non threatening up here. It's making me a little nervous. But we'll see. What the hell was that? There he is. Okay. Or she. I like to think of the giant hog as mama hog. It's like she's protecting her kids. Hmm? You don't want to keep dancing? There you go. That's what you get, you punk ass hog. And you know what's funny? I killed the mama hog. I never touched the kids. <laughs> I don't have any qualms against it, but I just don't need to. I'm going to kill... Just for fun, I'm not a psycho. Damn, man. There's no freaking loot in here. Like, I don't think there's one piece of loot in this one. Wow. Oh, this is... <laughs> it's an interesting build. Oh, there we go, machete. Oh, finally, we got one of these. Okay. Don't need those. Don't need that. Don't need that. You go. You go. You go. The machete's dope, though. I do like the machete. We put anything in there? Yeah, let's put this in there. Let's put that in there. All right. We finally found a... Finally found a crate. That's nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, here we go. Empty water bottle. So this is the, this is the one you need to make with uh, clay. And it holds five units of water. Now it's now it's looking up. Oh, is that a diving board? <laughs> diving board right next to my raft. I guess I see the way I'm going to be going down. Okay, barrels. Oh, barrels in this freaking island. Here, let's do this. See if that ends up anywhere near my raft. There we go. <laughs> I don't really, like, have any use for barrels. See, the thing is, barrels are one of the two things that you can use to make the raft flotation happen that is really, really good. Okay, I don't think the buoy balls look good at all, but the barrels and the tires look really good. I would argue the barrels probably look better overall, but I've used barrels on all my, like, on all my rafts. So, um, tires. Yeah, I'm not going to mess around any tires. Like I said in the last episode, I might at some point expand the raft. 
you know, uh, make it bigger, but it won't be like anytime soon. Thought I heard something running after me. Okay. That was just thing in the middle. It's weird. All right. Okay. Oh, potatoes. Take those. All right, now let's check out this one. Oh, crap, I never noticed that there was stuff around the sides. Nothing I really care about, though. All right, fair enough, let's go inside. Hope you can find another chest. Yeah, I'm going to tell you, I'm really surprised there's those snakes in these. Every time I ever did any player-made islands and they put these things down, there was, like, always snakes in them. Don't care about that. Definitely care about that. Oh, I'll take that. I'm not getting a lot of corrugation on this, corrugated stuff on this island, which is a problem because I need a lot of it. Nope. Nope. All right. Let's uh, let's do some inventory management. All right, looted this up, threw some stuff on the ground, got all my stuff organized. But that might be it for like this whole island. Oh no, I didn't go up here. Okay, nothing up here. Nothing up here, huh? All right. Okay. So, yeah, I think we're pretty much done. Um, there's a lot of stuff here I need to take with me, though. All right, I'm not going to lie. That water looks pretty shallow down there. And I have not saved the game because I've been up here the whole time. Um, oh, look at this. I didn't notice this. Oh, no, I got I to take that. I'll leave the stone. I'll be getting more stone anyway. All right, or is this going to be okay? I don't know. Let's try it. Okay, whew. Yeah. That is, that, I got that, like, sinking feeling in my stomach making that jump because I did not know, like, if I was up too high, if the, you know, ground below... Oh, boy, I didn't even see him. Oh, no. Oh. Okay, he's just hanging. He's hanging and banging. Can't throw spears at him. It doesn't work. So this guy's definitely respawned because I've killed everything on here. So... Yeah. I mean, I guess he could have wandered over here from somewhere. But, yeah, he's dead now. I don't think so, though. I think he respawned. And I don't think they're supposed to be respawning. But, it is what it is. Alright, so what we're going to do now is, I'm going to wait through the night. I'm going to organize everything. Wait through the night. You know, get, my, get this thing all situated. And then tomorrow, we're going to go into the... Um, the cavern areas. Make sure I didn't miss anything. Number one... And number two, we will also uh, uh, grab some stone while we're in there. All right, it's the next morning. So let's come on in here and see if we've missed anything. I don't think I have. Oh, yeah, that's right. I dropped a bunch of stuff. I don't need vehicle fuel vehicle parts. Definitely take the coconut flask. Very good. And he's just got a fishing spear. That's no big deal. I can make that. And we do have some clay over here. So I'll definitely grab some clay. I brought a lot of containers to put stuff in. And I'm going to get a lot of clay and a lot of stone in here. And I think what I'll do is I'll check some wrecks. I don't think I did too many wrecks on this island. Um, now, I might not get 100% of this island done today, but I'm going to consider it finished. You know, there'll probably be a couple wrecks I never did. Hopefully I didn't, like, miss anything too, like, important. But uh, the island's not going anywhere. It'll still be here. So if I did miss anything, I can always come back at a later date. All right. Let's put that in there. Alright, we'll put that in there as well. Oh, got a stone over here. Beautiful. And we'll drop that, and we'll start banging out on the stone. Alright, things on this island are definitely respawning. I had another giant hog come in. You know, that's fine. That's fine. It would make it a nice island to live on, because if this stuff keeps respawning, you could use its food and leather, you know, for quite a lot of things. I went ahead and did some inventory management. Also, when I came out of the... The cave system, I made a jump right here, and the, you know, the water was too shallow. 
So I did mess up my leg, so that was fun. So I had to limp around to make a splint, and I did make a splint. Um, it still says splint, though, so I'm not really sure if that means I'm, like, more apt to take damage now, or, you know, like, falling damage or whatnot, but so far I'm okay. Uh, now what we're going to do is we are going to go out, and we are going to check some of the wrecks around this island. And, um, you know, there's a little bit more on this island to do, uh, mostly the fact that I have so much... I have so much storage. Oh, come on, man. Make the turn, dude. This thing will not turn. It just refuses to turn. There. Come on. That's what happens when you make these things too big. They can hold more stuff, but they don't turn for crap now. You know, when they get bigger. Eh, it's understandable. So I did see some bubbles out here, but I'm not seeing them now, which is kind of odd. Hold on, let me take a look. Oh, I'm right over them. Okay, cool. Drop the line. Let's hope there's no sharks in the area. And our health should be pretty good. Yeah, we're good. There we are. Not a full wreck, it's just a little tiny wreck. Um, but I was hoping to find a container down here, but... Apparently there's nothing here. As far as I can tell. Alright, fair enough. Let's go on, fish. Any piranhas in this game? Maybe I should keep my mouth shut. Let's not give the let's not give the uh, the developers any ideas. So you see what I was talking about with these containers? How they're kind of in the way. I can't really see around me now. It's a little bit of a hassle, but I think it's definitely it's definitely worth it for the extra storage. I really don't have a problem with it. All right, so we're gonna back up a little bit. There's a little spit of land right here. I kind of want to take a look at. I don't think there's anything on it, but I'm gonna kind of take a look at it anyway. Just a, a yucca, yucca tree. Yeah. Yep, nothing there. Just a yucca tree. Alright, let's continue looking around. Let's see what we can find. Come on, man. Yeah, this thing, <laughs> this thing don't turn for shit. Like, turn, dude. Doesn't seem to be a lot of wrecks around this island, but I did find one right here. So we'll kind of take a look down there. Hopefully there's no sharks. Got some barrels. And more barrels. And that right there. Take that and that. We'll leave the battery empty. Ooh, duct tape. That's good. And over here. Is that it? Well, I have cleared that one out pretty quick. We're getting efficient at this. Unfortunately, I think that might be the, the last wreck around here, unless there's ones I, you know, am missing, which very well may be the case. Okay. All right, we got an island on our right. I've already been out there. Yeah, I think this place is just about done. I don't know if I ever looked at this one. This, this isn't a big wreck, but might be something to look at. There's definitely a chest down there. Which base is mine? I have a feeling that's my base. It looks pretty giant. Yeah, that's my base. Just want to make sure, because we will be going home after this. And then I'm going to have to go look for a new player-made island. Come on, get up there. Okay. Kind of panicked there. I saw a shark. Alright, so let's see what we got from these, from these cases. Oh, yeah, okay. I uh, don't need that or that. So we will just chuck these in the ocean. Uh, okay, get off my freaking raft. Get out of here. What's up, hammerhead? I'm going to have to kill that guy one day, just because I haven't killed a hammerhead shark yet. And what do we get in this one? Alright, not too bad. Not too bad at all. But you, my friend, will be going into the ocean. Maybe the sharks want to kill me because I keep dumping plastic into their ocean. I mean, they can't like that, right? Ah, they're only sharks. What the hell do they know? All they know is swim, eat, and... You know. You know what the other thing is. Alright, guys. I do think I'm going to head back to uh, the shore. I'm going to grab everything. I'm going to do some organization, get everything together. And we will be heading back to the main island. I'm not really sure what I'm going to do next episode. Um, it could be a... Oh, uh, have I? Yeah, that was the first one I did. It could be a building episode. I I'm not really sure. I'll have to kind of make up my mind when the 
when the day when the day comes. And the, I like to I like to keep myself open to possibilities. You know what I'm saying? All right, guys. If you haven't enjoyed the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.